Hello everyone and welcome to a new video for Infinity Kingdom. This is Biak here and I'm a British officer. In this video, I'm going to talk about the harbor. We had a new update and I didn't really give much attention to the new harbor. They replaced the sailing option here that you use to sail for 3 hours, 6 hours and 12 hours. And instead of this, they changed it into the harbor and as i told you guys i didn't give it attention because i thought this harbor wasn't a much thing to uh, care about and it was giving like a little rewards but when i reached level 20 i got tons of rewards so i'm curious how many rewards are going to increase even to level 30 35 we keep getting levels and even the rewards got better after only 20 levels. So after we reach level 60, how many um, rewards are going to get better? And the amount of rewards even at this level is, is crazy, guys. It's not like an ordinary uh, rewards. First of all, let me talk about this. We have weeks. Uh, every week we have three immortals. So for every week we have... Uh, destinated immortals that when you are using these immortals the drop rate will be in additionally increased for legendary and epic rewards i'm curious about the legendary rewards drop rate because for now we didn't see any legendary rewards but i'm just predicting the legendary rewards i will tell you about it uh for this week we have hippolyta it is in gray because i didn't use here i'm ha having this slot here and we have hannibal and also uh like elizabeth as well the amount of immortals you uh can use are limited so you have to pick the immortals carefully and every five levels you can use one more immortal so after level 25 i will be able to use one more immortal so right now let me just use hippolyta where is my hippo yeah uh, hippo hippo here as you see uh with after you i'm going to use hippolyta we have the rare rewards is going to be additionally two percentage and the other rewards are also going to be two percent when you are going to use an immortal or deploy the immortal into the harbor you will not be able to use this immortal inside your main marsh. For example, I just removed Loki and you can see the little icon here and also Hannibal uh, Hiborita, but you will be able to use uh, these immortals inside the arena and throne of supreme and also inside uh, or facing the time rift breaker. But if you want to, for example, to hunt bosses or the Titan Tola and you need one of these immortals, you have to remove them uh, okay, you have to remove them from the harbor exploration. You can record them and put them back again later. So for the rewards, I was removing Hippolyta. So these rewards could be even way more better uh, because I was uh, just having one less immortals than I used to have. And here I have random immortal fragments and this is epic. This is a new thing that came into the game. And I believe the legendary skills are going to be the same as this random immortal fragment. I believe if they just added it and this legendary uh, word here wasn't just a word. If it is going to be a legendary uh, rewards, I believe this is going to be one of the rewards. The legendary random immortal fragments. Maybe, maybe. We don't know yet. So as you see, I have here one hour of building speed ups uh, here, one hour and a quarter. This is two hour of healing speed ups just in five hours. And also we have almost two hours of training, uh, sorry, dragon and one hour and a half for research speed ups. We have some gold. Yeah, the gold rate is low, but in five hours, just in five hours, I got all of these speed ups and this amount of speed ups in is amazing and it's only just 20 levels guys uh i'm curious what great rewards we are going to get at level 30. uh this uh, video may be uh like late but i wanted to make this video sooner than enough because i didn't make much effort and attention about the harbor i wasn't even claiming the rewards for my immortals but after i got or i reached level 20 i immediately keep attention about the harbor and i keep collecting all the rewards early 
because the maximum rewards after level 20 I got is 7 hours and before that it was only 5 hours and after 5 levels I believe the amount of the maximum uh, harbor exploration is keep increasing we have uh, additional thing here uh, dispatch immortals to sale will additionally increase legendary and epic rewards for great and this is okay fine we have here weather it's windy right now and every weather have like a uh, drop rate uh, different than each other so for the weather we have sunny sunny has zero percentage rare five percentage for the authors uh, the overcast have zero percentage for everything for downpour we have zero percentage for rare minus two percentage for others and also for wind you have zero percentage for rare and minus three percentage for others so the best weather here is the sunny and we have some rules that we can fix the xp per minute we have xp increase the ship level for longer voyage and more rewards dispatch immortals that meet the conditions to an exploration for bonus rewards uh, dispatch already deployed immortals for exploration will withdraw them from their original unit and the weather will change every day and will affect reward drop rate when sailing the bonuses for every immortal dispatch five epic immortals will have the rare uh, percentage here increase and the maximum uh, amount of uh, rewards will be for dispatching 16 epic immortals that reached level 60 so this is didn't came into the game yet so right now we have only the 15 epic immortals at level 55 and have seven stars uh, for example i have here my immortals El Cid is okay, let me just use him El Cid is level 50 I, as i believe and hammurabi 55 all of them are seven stars so make sure that you are using the xb scrolls on the immortals that you don't use are epic and have them as seven stars so you can fill them into or dispatch them into exploration for the harp because after level 20 you are getting massive with speed ups and i i'm just curious about what are we going to get after level 30 or level 40 it's going to make a lot of differences and for the fragments it will uh, give you a random immortal if you can compose 60 fragments of them and my expectations for the legendary rewards are going to be the random immortal fragments for legendary this is just my uh, curiosity and expectations nothing is confirmed because no one has reached level 60 yet so um as i'm composing i keep getting random immortals here and all of these shards i have them as uh, like seven stars so i don't need these shards i can sell them right away. for the legendary rewards if they're going to give us a random uh, legendary uh, like fragments like this one here i don't think it will be useful for us because you have to wait for 60 or 80 uh, fragments to keep uh, collecting them i don't know where they are but yeah uh, it is what it is we have to wait to see the rewards and that's all for this video guys i hope you keep giving attention for this harbor and thank you for watching see you soon